Okay, welcome back to more Life is Strange 2. This is episode 6 of episode 1. The part 2 of episode 1. But I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. Let me think. Hey, the old guy's gone. M maybe you can enter from the store door. I can't escape. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is. Be careful. It might attract him. Keys. <sighs> of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Sean, is everything all right? Right. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Enano, I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm looking. Nothing else to look at. Sean, uh, I found something. Is this what you wanted? This is it. You rule, Daniel. Come on. Let's do this. Come on. Oh, this is a bad time for the controller to go a wonk. Yes! Good job, bro. Come on, you mother! Yes! Score! Did you do it? Here, here. Come on. Okay, hold on. Come on. Yes! Sean! Oh, God! I was so scared. What happened to your face? That old bastard happened. Okay. I 
We need to cut this off fast. How about these? Dude, you're Brock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. Oh, not again. Daniel? What? What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. Did you get Sonic Blast again? Steal or leave? Ugh. Let's... Let's leave. Move it. Let's go. Now. Come on. Come on. Wait. Shit. Watch out! Over there! L let's go! I don't know! That guy! Whoa, whoa, what are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me! You guys okay? You don't look okay. That asshole! At the gas station! We're fucking crazy! He tied me up in his back office! I swear to say no more. I believe you, okay? She's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us. Thank God we met this guy. was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you too? He started to earlier, but I bought too much stuff just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. The Saint Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kind of lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. Huh? <laughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. Did you just take the puppy? <sighs> Daniel. What? We saved her. <laughs> We're heroes. Yeah. Guess we are. <laughs> so. What should her name be? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? Mushroom? Really looks like a mushroom. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. <laughs> cares i'm sure she loves it so do i all right mushroom it is then 
<laughs> oh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I feel like I just witnessed history. You're all <laughs> becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Eh, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. So how do you make money? <laughs> Spoken like a real American. <laughs> Just curious, now that we're urban nomads too, if you have any tips. I sell shit, like a good capitalist. Stories when I can, eBay when I can't. My biggest expense is gas and food, so it's easy. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Another cop break song. <laughs> Look at that. Oregon Whoa. is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. You do? Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast.
well, we started the fight. It was all my fault. Daniel wanted to play saw me, and of course I told him to get lost, and our asshole neighbor was picking on him, and I freaked out. So Dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops, and they killed my dad in front of me. It's all my fucking fault. All I had to do was play with Daniel, and Dad would still be alive. I fucked up my whole family, and now we're alone. Hey, it's gonna be all right. Take a deep breath. It's not your fault. You don't have control over all this stuff. You can't blame yourself for everything that happens in this world. You're gonna be okay, Sean. How? My life feels like... like that town down there. Wiped out. Destroyed. Empty. Like I have nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? I don't know. I was... Where are they going? I was thinking... Get out of the country, fuck it, go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn, I thought I was the long haul traveler. <sighs> Should I go back uh, to Seattle? Maybe I can try and explain everything. What happened? You should do what you think is best. If going to Mexico seems like the right thing to do, then so be it. You're going in the right direction. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad... He always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Well, that's gonna end this part.
I'll see you guys next time with more Life is Strange 2. Nice try, controller, but the part's already over. Haha! <laughs>